welcome student on target of e study channel in this lecture i will complete 20 mcq series with answer on semiconductor devices and the first series is on semiconductor basis first question is which among the following is the most commonly used semiconductor and the correct answer is silicon because silicon have a specific temperature range than germanium the next question is what happened to the resistance of a pure semiconductor when heated and the correct option is the resistance decreases because when we increase temperature the resistance is decreases so semiconductor is called ntc the third question is a semiconductor is formed by dash dash bonds and the correct option is covalent because covalent bond is formed by sharing of electrons also semiconductor is formed by sharing of electron so covalent bond is present on semiconductor the next question is a semiconductor has generally dash dash valency electrons and the correct option is 4 because all semiconductor are tetravalent valency electron the next question when a pentavalent impurity is added to a pure semiconductor it becomes and the correct option is n type semiconductor because when we add pentavalent impurity in a pure semiconductor then its four electron sharing with valency electron of semiconductor and the fifth one remains free so when we add pentavalent then there are majority charge of electrons so this type of semiconductor is called n type semiconductor the next question a pentavalent impurity has dash dash valency electron and the correct option is 5 penta means it have a 5 valency electron in its outermost orbit the next question addition of pentavalent impurity to a semiconductor creates many dash dash and the correct option is free electron because its four electron is share with semiconductor material and the fifth one remains free so the correct option is free electrons the next question the battery connection required to a forward bias a pn junctions are and the correct option is positive terminal to p type and negative terminal to n type the next question a pn junction acts as a and the correct option is a unidirectional switch because pn junction when we apply forward voltage it conducts and when we apply reverse voltage then it does not conduct so pn junction is a unidirectional switch the leakage current across a pn junction is due to and the correct answer is minority carrier the next question is the resistivity of a semiconductor dash dash conductor and insulator and the correct option is lies between that of because semiconductor have a low resistivity at zero temperature and when we increase temperature it resistivity is decreases so it behave as a insulator at low temperature and it is a acts as a conductor at a high temperature so semiconductor's property lies between conductor and insulator the next question is in a semiconductor the energy gap between the valency band and conduction band is about and the correct option is 1 electron volt the next question with forward bias to a pn junction the width of deflection layer and the correct option is decreases the next question in an intrinsic semiconductor the number of free electron dash dash and the correct option is equals the number of holes due to mass action law 
n is equal to p means number of free electron is equal to number of holes the next question a hole in a semiconductor is defined as and the correct option is the incomplete part of an electron pair bond that means holes is absence of electron the next question in the deflection region of a pn junction there is a shortage of dash dash and the correct option is holes and electrons because in deflection region there is a immobile ions so the correct option is holes and electrons the next question is a semiconductor has dash dash temperature coefficient of resistance and the correct option is that negative because it resistance is decrease with temperature is increase the next question as a general rule holes are found only in dash dash and the correct option is semiconductor the next question the term bias means and the correct option is dc voltage applied to an electronic devices when we apply biasing means dc voltage applied to a devices when we connect dc voltage in a forward bias to a pn junction then it conducts and in reverse bias does not conduct so there is two types of biasing forward and reverse so biasing means dc voltage applied the next question is in a semiconductor current conduction is due to and the correct option is holes and free electrons because in semiconductor holes and free electrons are present if you like video then please subscribe and press bell icon for notification of upcoming video lecture